I'm a potato. What were we talking about? Potato. I don't remember. We were looking at Ashley. Yeah. I find it funny that um, they took this photograph of her in her outfit, and then this is the exact same outfit that she wears throughout the whole game. Like, that's her only outfit. Also, like, she looks like a brunette in that. She does kind of look like a brunette. She's not a brunette. <laughs> Very much a blonde. What I don't get is that if she's gone to university, then is it anywhere near the White House or was it somewhere in America? Go to university, like, in Europe? Nah, because they said that they cited her in Europe. She's just the daughter of the United States president. She was kidnapped while on her way home from her university. Home has to be the White House, doesn't it? Not necessarily, like, it could be her door. Maybe. We're analyzing this game too much. Let's just... <laughs> or it's just like, just her title is officially Ashley Graham, the President's Daughter. Which is just like, President of the Resident Evil Fan Club? <laughs> it's it's like I think it's really weird that it's the president's daughter that they kidnapped. It literally could have been anyone. Well, then there's no excuse. <laughs> okay, I want to point out a mistake, and I don't know if this is the texture pack I'm using or something else. So. I look to the left. Do you see that N? You see what's to the what right of the N? I don't see the N. No, 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 no. Up, up on the uh, compass. Uh oh, the north. Yeah. Yeah. You see what's to the right of the N? I'm not following what you mean. Tell me I'm not crazy, but if you had a compass down in front of you, to the right of the end would not be the west. It would be the east, right? Oh, no, you're blowing my mind right now, dude. <laughs> it's, this compass, I don't know if the texture pack did it or not, but this compass is wrong. <laughs> Unless the world is flipped, like Twilight Princess. <laughs> Oh, also Tam when the that, guy died. That's, that, that's what happened with that guy. Yeah. So I count four guys just out there right now. Can, can I bring up something I just thought of? <laughs> so they burned that cop instead of, you know, indoctrinating him and using him to get into the government? Yeah, I don't know why they did that. Like, I don't know why they don't do any of that, because, like... Why did they start in this village? They could literally start anywhere else. Okay. I'm gonna be sneaky. Okay. Episode 20... Five of Symphony Nights going up, and I'm editing 26. <laughs> or uh, 26 is the last thing I should say. Oh god! At a crisp. Get down from there. At a crisp 62 FPS. Or 62.5. Get down from there. What if he doesn't want to? You shot him and he fell back. He's still not down for the fire. You made him not fall. Feel shame. <laughs> oh my god, what? What are y'all doing in there? You! Get down! Watch this. 
Bam! Wait a minute. Oh no. Weird thing that for the reasons that I was just looking at. Hacking uh Hacking DBZ abridged Cell's final episode came out. Episode six. Yeah. Between the Justifon. The last episode of Hells in K. Do, do you really Why are these people? Chainsaw. Chainsaw man. Doctor Salvador. Shit. Um, I don't think it's exactly Doctor Salvador. Son of He'd be kicked out. <laughs> I don't think these people were protected by the Constitution. Like, just thinking about it, I don't think. That's exactly how American treats us. And they heard you were breaking the Constitution, and now they're here. But... <laughs> they're actually very American. Oh my god, the Chainsaw Man's here! Here he is. It's Salvador. Here we get back! That didn't happen. I remember that scream. Oh no, he's chasing me! To my own admission, I do feel like the safety of the knights really did slow down near the end of them. Just because of how far apart we recorded them. You know? Right. Don't get closer. I'll make it burn. Burn! That hurt me. Good job. Good job. Should protect me though. And Beezle Bob, but his but how he attacked one of the bees. So it's Beezle Bob, and I made that fun, and I got oh, so fucking <laughs> mad with yourself. Yeah. I didn't oh, get to kill the chainsaw oh. man, that means I didn't get the money. And I just repeated it, and it made me more like, like it's, not going. it's not Bingo? funny. Why'd you make that joke? When also Resident Evil started. Oh yeah, that was just a prologue. <laughs> I think that is a prologue. Get, um, apparently there was a demo news. of this game that came out very, very Something's early. Happened to the people here. 
and Leon, you need to get it out went up into Look the village and it ended and after follow that. The trail near it. Got it. God, I suck at I suck at this. I didn't just, kill Dr. Yeah, I killed Dr. Salvador. When you kill Dr. Salvador, you're supposed to get like a lot of money, which I could have used, but I'm gonna leave the cows alone. <laughs> oh wow, another one. <laughs> Wait a minute, is is this the fucking episode where you learn you can swim with the dog? Oh no, is it? Don't do this to me. No, it's not. It's gonna be episode where you clip up the waterfall with the dog. Because I don't know I can swim up it. <laughs> I just noticed that whenever uh... I use the water, the dog, it inches me up a bit. Hmm, I wonder why. It's, it's almost like the dog can swim or something. I cannot believe it took me so long to learn that. Um, just for clarification, this probably You're hasn't gone yet. done with the game. Uh, I'm being right before, before I start uploading Resident Evil's. Just so you know. Right, so like... So people will have seen the symphony of it. So like, at this point, that episode will have gone up, and I just want to talk about it a bit. So in that scene, um... I remember just I don't know Symphony of the Night I never played it I never even looked at it much but I knew it was supposed to be a good game and I like Castlevania and Metroidvania so I just wanted to play it and my gosh what an experience it was but I cannot get over the fact that like I don't think we even learned all the spells that there were just because there was like yeah, there no was still resource spare spells we had never used by the end of it. We probably would have known if we had the uh, <laughs> manual, but uh, we were naughty. Well, like I, I left all of those just being randomly found. But like during the first part, I did lead you a bit, but when we get into the first castle, I just stopped telling you stuff. Right, and that's how you maybe. <laughs> you made me. I don't know if that was the case, but even then, it was just... We ended up fighting, like, one of the harder, or if not the hardest boss. What was his name? Gilgamesh or something like that? Uh, yeah. So we ended up fighting Gilgamesh, the freaking two-story tall goat, or dog, monster thing. And then right after that, we fought a mummy. Why the fuck did... Did... I... Did... Okay, let me... It just said that Euro Truck Simulator and Jackbox got posted. But like, that's been posted forever. Uh... <laughs> like, I never took that down. <laughs> oh, I know what it is. Oh, wow. I know what it is. Remember when you accidentally streamed? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, this was a stream for four minutes ago. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so right now I'm just going around trying to find uh, stuff to loot. So that I am prepared. Okay, that, that makes sense. <laughs> Thank you for affirming my uh, action. <laughs> Okay. It's actually really nice to be back in the group of it. I'm not gonna lie. You like going over all the stuff? Yeah. Nice. Next thing is going to be I'm going to edit the Brandon's leaving special footage. <laughs> and that's going to be the next thing that goes up on the channel. Are you gonna post the special oh. footage? No. No, that's getting saved for Dokkapon Season 2's extended trailer. The only difference between the extended trailer and the normal trailer 
is going to be this special footage where we put at the end, and it will not be up to YouTube. <laughs> I'm telling you, annotate it and hide it. Yeah, I got it. I'm just gonna do a small ARG to find the hidden footage. Oh my god. A small ARG, it's going to be hidden in the video. Uh, here's, here's the numbers. Um, seven. Two. Uh, Jellymon, are you still there? Yeah, I'm here. Think of a number. Uh, between what and what? Any number. Do you want me to say it? Yes. Twelve. That's a good number. Twenty-one. <laughs> I forgot the number I said before, but, you know, that one. Yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. Not even we know the secret of the ARJ. That's the point. Uh, 30? 11 TK Jigger William. That is not a number. You just made it impossible. <laughs> Excuse you. Excuse you. That's Brandon's favorite number? How dare you deny me? <laughs> deny the existence. How dare you? I, I forgive me. I'm when Brandon gets back. When Brandon gets back, I'm gonna tell him you denied a living kid figure, and no, he's gonna be angry at you. Don't tell him. <laughs> he might get mad. Oh wait, let me look at that again. It's not like he hasn't gotten mad before. True. Especially your dog. Fun. Whoa! Whoa! Look at this guy. <laughs> He thought he was smart. He's all about smart. Five seconds. Oh, we should play him a Yojin bro. Oh my gosh. That was a weird little game. I thought it would be more than what it was. It wasn't bad by me. Right. Like, for what it was, it was good. Which is a little ninja. Uh... Gun game. It was not a gun game. They had guns. You had a dedicated shoot button. Okay, true, but like... It was mostly swords. Oh yeah, it's not like we... We didn't use a gun in a free second. <laughs> that game was weird, I couldn't really understand the mechanics. Dead people. Gross. I keep collecting chicken eggs. Episode 26 of Castlevania. I can't believe we started Castlevania first. But. But, like, Dokapon has massively surpassed it in episode count. <laughs> Yeah, rapid is so fast as well. We play games a lot. <laughs> uh, that is a lie. Oh, we play games. Kinda. We play games a lot. A lot of them. We don't record. But we play game. <laughs> I don't know, it almost feels appropriate that, like, next week is Christmas week. Merry Christmas! And, like, that's one I'll be uploading the brand new content. It'll be a Christmas it... miracle. Brandon comes back and he's just like, guys, I have the nuclear codes. I've stolen the nuclear. It's time. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why did that guy die so fast? Is that a game mechanic? If you shoot somebody in the middle of their attack animation, they take double damage? I don't know. Because I, I just saw that guy and I shot him point blank in the face. I think I think that guy just wanted to make you look bad. 
Like I wanna be wanted to make me look good. Oh uh, yeah, we should play on the channel. What? <laughs> Kingdom Hearts. But all oh, of them. Oh my god. All of them. All of the Kingdom Hearts. I beat Kingdom Hearts this year. The first one. I thought it was a weird game. Because yeah, Kingdom Hearts 3 is kinda cool. Kingdom Hearts 3 is gonna come out in the next year and it'll be a good time to start playing them down the line. <laughs> What games are coming out this year? Like, the rest of this year? Like, you're talking about playing 76, well, not 76, but at this point, like. There's really, like. Even Brandon himself. I would feel so bad for Brandon because he really wanted to play it. He really wanted to play it, and he's gonna get back and just hear how bad everything went. What With if that's conversation 76. that basic right now? We're just like, guys, I heard Fallout 76 was bad, and they're just like, I don't want to go back. You can't make me. I, I don't know if he would have heard about it, considering basic and all. Right, but... but like, he's going to be so sad when he back. <laughs> it's like, we lost them. We lost Bethesda. <laughs> They have converted to the dark side. I'm playing, you know, the horse armor wasn't designed. They'd already got. I mean, that was like almost ten. That was ten years ago. <laughs> I'm mean, like he making jokes about it since. But now it's like it's not even tongue in cheek. They're just oblivious. They're doing the same sure. thing now. Everyone thought that back in the day, the horse armor was supposed to be uh, set a precedent that a consumer is not going to accept meaningless uh, DLC, especially at the prices that they've charged for. Six dollars for two sets of useless horse armor. And they're doing it again. There's microtransactions in the Fallout 76. There's a uh, holiday outfits that they have now. Um, Twelve dollars. Get the whole pack. And like, yeah, oh, you can get in-game currency through playing the game, but like, still, it's twelve dollars. Isn't it like the most in-game currency games in-game at a really like slow pace? Yeah, you get it, and there's no real way to speed it up rather than just play it. So it inflates some um, player times. You know what's sad? What? People are enjoying goddamn No Man's Sky more than Fallout 76. No Man's Sky had a thing going for it. It's the fact that it was made by an indie company. People were way too harsh on it, I feel. They expected way too much of a little baby game. The only other game that No Man's Sky, or Hello Games had made at that point was freaking. I forgot his name, but it was like a, it was like a mobile game, and then they wanted to jump into No Man's Sky, and it's just like, what the heck? And like, it's grown into expectations. Yeah, um, you know, me and you and I haven't played No Man's Sky, and we will say it's pretty much exactly what their original vision was now. At least yeah, for what they good said. Multiplayer. Like, it's not the best, but it's not horrible. You can't really play together, like, nat naturally, but you have to go to a co-op lobby. Like, three years down the line, everything that they said was going to be in the game is there. It might not have the best gameplay or the best implementation, but it is there now. It took them three extra years, because they lost three years. Like, did you, do you know about that story? Um, no Man's Sky's development. Yeah. Their studio. Their, their studio didn't get flooded. Yes, they got hit with a flash flood and they lost so much data. Oh, oh my, my favorite goodness. part. This, this part. This is stupid because you got to mash X and then it's gonna tell you uh, click left and right on the mouse. 
What did I say? Mm -hmm. I knew that would happen. I need you to check on Ocarina of Time multiplayer. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> we are in the co op multiplayer mod for any of time at some point. If it ever comes out, which I really hope it does. I'm like, I'm not gonna lie, I'm in the camp of the play with. What was that? You play it with a randomizer. You just sh 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 see. Oh gosh. If randomizer would be scary. It's great. How does the randomizer work? Uh, I don't remember. Port to 1.0 had begun. Has begun. It's about to come out in 1.0. Oh my gosh! It is now 100% ROM patch free, so you don't need to patch your ROM at all. It's just like uh. Boom. Just like uh. Mario 64. traps which I don't think I see any Not in front of me okay there's a few oh no do that it was you <gasps> I shot that in the air you made him perish I can't hit that <laughs> I don't want to walk closer to it to hit it Spiders, ew. Ew. Perish. Perish. You have to deal with spiders because I think they'll jump at you and you'll actually take damage. <sighs> uh, Claremont's watching Dracula Netflix. Oh and, boy. And she's just sent me, I am Trevor fucking Belmont, and I've never lost a fight to any man or beast. And I'm like, Oh, he did. And then he got kicked in the nuts. Like, <laughs> morally, he lost that fight. Morally, he lost that fight. Emotionally, he lost that fight. <laughs> physically. He didn't lose the fight physically. He took out, like, two men before he got taken out. Physically. Numbers wise, he won. Emotionally, he's damaged the honor. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I never noticed this house up here. Wait a minute. You see this thing? Yeah. I wanna get up there. There's no way up there. No. Turn on your notebook packs. I don't got those. There's a house up there, too. Oh, you just made me think of a bonus episode for it. For this. What? We go into Dolphin and explore those houses with the notebook. <laughs> oh god. Just explore bits of the game with notebook. Do you agree? I mean. I don't see why not. Bob knows my love of no clipping shit. You found you found the free cam looking dolphin and you just fell in love with it. Uh, fun fact: I knew about the free cam since a long time ago when I was playing Twilight Princess. Oh really? And so I would fap about with the Twilight Princess, but and that's why it was on by default and why I accidentally found it while playing Pokemon. Was it's just been on since like three years ago? Oh my gosh. I just never used the keyboard, so I never knew. There's one thing about Dolphin 
and it's that it will keep your uh, settings, like no matter what. With Dolphin, I remember I used to play Soul Calibur 2, but then I changed the setting in it and it caused it to break. And I was never able to play it for four years. I was never able to play it on Dolphin. Until I went through, found the config file for Soul Calibur 2, deleted it, and then now the game runs again. Uh, I still have a version of Brawl that boots into uh, Project M. Lucky. <laughs> I mean, I also have Project M ISO now, so. Ready for this? No. It, is that dude in the closet? We gotta get him the, out of the closet. The researcher dude? He's our bro, we gotta get him out of the closet. Bro. Coming out day! Bro. Mm. Ah. Oh. You know, rough, don't you think? And that's why he doesn't have a mustache anymore. <sighs> Oh, that makes sense. You're not like them. <laughs> Beta yeah. Louis did. You? Louis did have a mustache. <laughs> That's why he doesn't have a mustache. I have only one. I never only realized one. that. You have smoke. <laughs> Perfect. I never realized that, Teflon. Why do you have to bring that up? <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't even know he had a mustache! I was just making a joke! <laughs> yeah, Beta Louise had a mustache, and then it got removed. That's why! Uh... Someone at Capcom had to go, wait a minute, we do this animation where Leon tears the tape off his face. That waxes his mustache! Do you think we should stop? Because it is, it is now been an hour. Yeah, we have already played for an hour. <laughs> Feeble humans, let us give you. Our Let's play power. through this animation real quick. <laughs> Soon, you will become unable to resist this intoxicating power. someone play this and they were talking about hey you get to these hey, animation these cutscenes uh, and they're the yeah, worst because yeah. you can't just like I don't think you can skip Crawl this one if one you haven't seen it yet and into another so like if you, you don't care you just walk away here? and do something Americano see now what and you'll see what happens look like you to this part of the world oh, mm -hmm. hey, I don't remember what happens see, this part. whoever you are <sighs> name's Leon Came here looking for this girl. Seen her? Now she looks. What are you supposed to be a cop or something? There's the lighting. Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter. Oh my goodness, do you know what? You're... That's too good for a guess. Want to start explaining? Psychic powers. We should do it when we see the merchants first. Huh? <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. But now I'm just a good-for-nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. Why'd you quit? Phew, <laughs> policia. You put your life on the line Nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. I used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. <laughs> Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. 
Naughty boy, I'm not dying. So you're still away. After you. And then you come back. And if you didn't do that, you would have been died. You would have come back to the game over screen. Someone should remake Resident Evil 4, but it's co-op with Louise. That'd be great. It's Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was a bit tied up. You're okay, right? I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No. But apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm Why heading back secret? to the village. Someone was actually asking about Resident Evil 4 co-op mod. Really? Yeah. And did anyone take them seriously? Or was anyone just like, ah, no. <gasps> Over here, stranger. Stranger. That's my emotional support, Donato. Well, all right. I think that's a good time to stop. Yeah, the emotional support guy is the best time to stop. Mm hmm So, next time, we'll probably keep playing, meet the merchant, and head on out. So and far, and feel better about ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> In um, pro mode. It's not too hard. I'm bummed out that I messed up enough to not get the, uh, not get the, uh, you know, talk to Salvador's money, but meh. I'll have more chances. Alright. Money, 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 money. Bye bye.